Hi, this is Natalie Rydstrom from SBR Picks. Now we're going to preview the Premier League match Chelsea versus Swansea, playing on Saturday with guest Stuart from betadvisor.com. Stuart, thanks for being here. Hi, Natalie. Now, the obvious favourites in this match is the home team, Chelsea. Now, whilst their odds for a straight win off of a little value price, 1.3, would you be tempted to combine their bet with the over or the under two and a half goals? Um, I might be tempted, depending on the odds, on going with the over as well. OK. Now, the Swans have failed to score in their last five head-to-heads. Quite a remarkable achievement, really, from the Blues. Is it about time they pocketed a goal? Or would your bet be on um, the Blues keeping a clean sheet that's priced at two? Um, well, personally, I think that they're going to get a goal. But, you know, just saying that they're going to get it because they haven't scored in the last five, that could be a little bit of the gambler's fallacy coming in. And we want to avoid that. But it comes down to whether or not we think uh, Swansea are good enough to get a goal in this one. I think they are, just about. All right. Well, both teams to score is priced at 2.25. And then you can combine the Chelsea win and both teams to score. And that gives you odds of 3.4 with Coral. Is that enough odds there to tempt you into making that bet? Uh, I think you know how I feel about combination I bets. Um, probably <laughs> not high enough for me. I'd want to be really, really tempted. All right, so not high enough. OK. Well, <laughs> do you know another bet, though? I, this is not really a bet normally I take. Um, it's anytime goal scorer. And you've got some good options here. You've got Diego Costa, who's priced at 2. Loic Remy, priced at 2.1. And Drogba, priced at 2.2. Are those odds enough to tempt you into making that bet? And if you had to choose one, which one would it be? If I had to choose one, it would probably be Loic Remy because I think Diego Costa might actually be rested for the Schalke game in midweek. Mm -hmm. So that's uh, an option. Probably not one I'd take, though, because it's not a market I like to get into. OK. Now, um, Chelsea, uh, another bet I quite like is Chelsea minus 1.5 on the Asian handicap line, um, and that's priced around evens. What about that bet? Well, Jason Mills would be very happy to hear you say that because that's his a bet for this one as well. So he's going for Chelsea minus 1.5. You've got that one bang on the head. OK, well, I have to say I do like this Jason Mills. The more we do these videos, uh, it seems that we think alike here. <laughs> but uh, what is your top tip you have from the team at Bet Advisor for us today, Stuart? Well, you've already guessed Jason's tip, uh, you know, so you did well there. Uh, Gregor is actually agreeing with me. I think this is the first time we've ever agreed on the selection, but we're both going for both teams to score. So we're going for both teams to score, yes. That's available at 2.2 with Bet365, and I think that's a pretty good bet. OK, so a couple of options there to consider. Stuart is from betadvisor.com, a multi-sport, multi-tipster platform. And if you want to check out their website and the services they offer, simply click the logo on the top right of the screen. Stuart, thanks again for joining us. Anytime. The SBR Network offers free sports picks and game breakdowns. Big money free betting contests year-round. A real-time Vegas-style odds monitoring service and much more. So come see for yourself. To stay updated on SBR news and promotions, follow us on Twitter, Facebook and Google+. And do be sure to subscribe to the Sportsbook Review YouTube channel to catch all our daily sports shows.